decorations, laughing children, overflowing orange bowls of sweet, sweet candy. Bah! Is there anything more foul than Halloween? Minions, formation! My fellow night dwellers, there was a time when Halloween was a night for darkness and evil. A night when people locked themselves indoors and shivered in fear. Now, Halloween is a time not for darkness, but for sweet, gooey candy and fun. And so tonight, we shall reclaim Halloween and take back the darkness. <laughs> Minions! Up. Move out to the... are supposed to be gross. Maggots, that's you, eat rotting meat. That's me. But we look ridiculous, revolting. Everyone at the Halloween dance will laugh at us or barf on us. Oh, let's hope so. <laughs> and do we really have to be attached? What if I have to use the bathroom? To win this costume contest? Oh, that is a risk I am willing to take. Well, good luck. <laughs> Oh, hi, Abby. See, now that's a scary costume. It's not supposed to be scary. It's supposed to be instructional. Not enough people know how many bones are in the human body. Scapula, clavicle, patella. It's 206. And every one of them calcified perfection. We all know who's taking home first prize. Right. Not with Paige doing the judging. Paige? Oh, man. She's doing everything this year. Not only is she in charge of the costume contest, oh. <laughs> but the refreshments, Yee! and even the haunted house. <laughs> I had to take the only job left, decorating. So, um, uh, Abby, uh, since you'll be there anyway, I was wondering if uh, you might want to, uh, you know, uh, dance with me or something. Um, sure, why not? <laughs> <laughs> but you two can't be joined at the hip. I am not dancing with my brother. Abby, a little help. Oh, the zipper's stuck. <laughs> Hurry up, lab rat. Do you have any idea how uncomfortable this thing was to sleep in? This modified lubricant should do the trick. <gasps> My costume! Uh, sorry, uh, wrong bottle. P.U. It was hot in there, okay? Gotta say, though, maggot and meat? Great costume. I never took you for a maggot fan. Little white fly larvae that eat rotting slop? <laughs> What's not to like? Then you are gonna love my latest invention. Ta-da! Cool! Huh. What is it? 
a fly factory, so I'll always have a fresh supply for decomposition experiments. Normally, the life cycle of a fly is 13 days from egg to maggot to fly. But with this, I can cut that down to like a day. Uh, lab rat, when was the last time you got out of the lab? <gasps> I have no idea. Grossologists! A terrible gross crime has been committed at the food depot. The city's last shipment of Halloween pumpkins has been destroyed. What's gross about that? Have you ever tried to carve one of these things? <laughs> the stringy gobs of greasy, oh, orange pumpkin guts, and <laughs> the smell. <sighs> if there's a pumpkin squasher on the loose, he must be stopped. My little Clarence just loves pumpkins. Oh, and this is the last one in town. <laughs> Please hurry. Hmm, let's just get this over with. I've got a costume to fix. Wow, smashed pumpkins. The crime of the century. Ty, check it out. Scat, animal droppings. It's everywhere. This must be one big animal. Try a whole lot of little ones. I'm reading poop from a wide variety of species. Raccoons, skunks, cats, rats, even frogs. And every pile has pumpkin seeds. So all these animals ganged up on the pumpkins? Well, what did pumpkins ever do to them? And why would they work together? I mean, a rat eating pumpkin right next to a cat? That's weird. Grossologists! I'm getting reports that your school is being overrun by wild animals! Check it out! And Harry! Think it's our pumpkin poopers? Come on! It's quiet. Yeah, too quiet. Ugh. Hey, you're the one who started with the cliches. Ah! <gasps> You don't want to eat me! I'm 80% crystal! Yeah. Hey, furballs! Stick around! Ty, check out the orange stains around their mouths. Pumpkin confirmed. Looks like we found our gourd gobblers. <laughs> <laughs> Been cut. I'll shed some light on this. Let's go. Um, Ty, we've got bigger problems. This rat is flat. <gasps> we gotta get that flat rat back to the gag lab. Stat. Try saying that three times fast. <sighs> I'm telling you, I've never seen anything like this. I mean, like never, as in ever. These animals are completely healthy. Except for the fact that they're also all dead! Dead? What makes you say that? For one thing, the eyes have clouded over with potassium because their blood cells have stopped circulating. And for two, they have no heartbeats and they're not breathing! <gasps> Zombies. Just like in horror movies. <laughs> <laughs> There's no such thing as zombies. Come on, we're scientists. Let's focus on what we know. These animals are nocturnal, right? That means they don't normally come out in daylight. Maybe that's why the power was cut in the school. No lights. But it still doesn't explain their crazy behavior. Or that strange dude you saw in the hall. Yeah, who was that guy? People of the light. Dark little <laughs> crevasse. I knew it. All right. This year, I am taking back the night of October 31st and plunging it into glorious darkness. Come Halloween night, anyone foolish enough to dress up or trick or treat will face the unyielding wrath of my zombie roadkill army. Oh, and one more thing. Boo! <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor little Clarence. His Halloween party will be ruined. All because one madman hates Halloween fun. You must find a way to defeat Darko Crevasse and his zombie roadkill army before he completely destroys Halloween. 
But how do you defeat something that's already dead? Don't look at me. That's your job. Just do it fast before Clarence gets, oh, <laughs> angry. I didn't know you volunteered for roadkill cleanup duty, Detective. Of course. I got a soft spot for the poor little critters. So the city just buries them along the side of the road? Well, what else can we do? Over a million animals are hit by cars every day in North America. So how does this happen? Well, how do you think it happens? Nice. No, I mean, wouldn't they see the cars coming? Nocturnal animals have photosensitive eyes that let them see in the dark? Yeah, but that works against them. Because their eyes are, are super sensitive to light, bright headlights can temporarily blind them. Poor little critters. It'd be like you or me looking into the sun, which, by the way, you should never do. Oh, wow! That is bright. Oh. Hey, what if we use light to blind Darko's army? Won't work. Labrat said their eyes are already clouded over with potassium, remember? Uh, say, kids, c can you point me down the road a bit? I got a deceased moose to get to before the maggots do. Ow. Wait a minute, did he say? Yeah, maggots. <laughs> Here we go, Rizzo. You named the rat. Don't be silly. I named the maggot. You guys were right. These roadkill zombies are not fond of maggots. No wonder. Maggots eat rotting flesh until there's nothing left but bone. Hmm. We've got a whole arsenal right here. Whoa, whoa, whoa! These maggots are at a very sensitive stage. They could pupate into flies any minute now. Lab rat, you can always make more flies, but Halloween is tonight. We need these maggots. Yeah, they're the only thing that can stop the zombie roadkill army. <sighs> I guess I could rig the goob shooters to fire maggots, but you'd better return every one of them. There will be a head count. It is such a fine line between scientist and mad scientist. Now where could our rotting army be? Actually, I think I know exactly where to look. Oh, oh, you're just in time. Huh? <laughs> oh, Clarence, we have guests. are here for the party, right? Um, sure. Woohoo! Party! <laughs> See? See, Clarence? I told you this would be fun! I, I told you! <laughs> what are you really doing here? We figured you'd have a nice turnout of Darko's zombie roadkill army looking to tear the place apart. What? Zombies? Here? I thought I told you to! Seven tenths split. Ah, oh, tough break. Okay, maggots, do your thing. It's working again. What is that? Labrat was right. Oh, the maggots matured too soon. Oh, they're all turning into flies. Now what do we do? No ammo, no backup plan, and no way out! Hey, Ty, let's bowl! Now? Are you out? Ah! <laughs> Leave it to Roadkill to wind up in the gutter. Labrat, come in! Labrat, we need more maggots! 
But all I've got are eggs. They won't be maggots for at least a few hours. That's time we don't have. Okay, okay. Let me see what I can do. We have to round up these animals. Now, if I was a zombie raccoon, where would I hang out? Wait, why aren't they following us? Maybe they can't open a door without, you know, opposable thumbs. Hold on. They canceled the school dance, right? Yeah. But I didn't take down the Halloween decorations. <gasps> They're headed for the school. Whoa, nice job on the decorations. Yeah, too bad no one will get to see it. <laughs> hey, guys. Andy, uh, what are you doing here? Abby said she'd dance with me. Zombies or no zombies, I couldn't miss that. Uh -huh. Hey, Ty, you were supposed to wear the rotting meat costume, not some lame race car driver outfit. Uh, <laughs> you see, Andy, we, uh, uh... Well, well, look at this group of Halloweenies. Paige, what are you doing here? Are you kidding? <laughs> I couldn't let this totally awesome and expensive costume go to waste. Little Bo Peep! <laughs> and no creepy weirdo goth loser is gonna stop me. Oh, come now! While it might be true that I'm, uh, as you say, creepy, calling me goth, well, that's just insulting! Ah! Oh, screaming won't help, my dear. But feel free to continue. I find it most enjoyable. Ew! What? Enough with the pleasantries. Minions, devour whatever is left of Halloween. Revelers included. Any ideas? I, uh, <laughs> I have to admit, Darko, pretty ingenious scheme you got here. What, this old scheme? Just something I threw together? Ah, you're too modest. Only a certified genius could have come up with such an ingenious plan. But, as a fellow scientist, I do have just one teensy-weensy question. Oh, very well. I don't like to toot my own horn, but, um, ask away. How on earth did you train these animals to attack only Halloween things? I'm so glad someone finally asked. You won't believe it. Flashcards. Simple flashcards! Mm. Oh, wow. Mm. That's... Impressive. Combined with my training as a part-time zookeeper, I... Uh, uh, hey, uh, wait a minute. Never mind how I did it. Minions, finish them off. We need a diversion. <laughs> Thanks, Andy. Or what? This. <laughs> if I don't make it, tell Andy I am. Good one. Andy looks just like a giant maggot. <laughs> It's just a costume! Where did I put those flashcards? Oh, forget him! Destroy them! What? <laughs> You'll need to do better than that if you want to escape. Oh, at least my costume is safe. Yoink. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Trick or treat, little Bo Darko. Miscreant! How dare you! Ooh, zombies! Here's a trick or treater who needs a tacky! What? No, not me, please! Stop! No! No! Time to get this party started. Fire maggots! No! No! Yuck! Look at those maggots go! It's like an all-you-can-eat zombie buffet! <gasps> Aw, the poor little things. No! My minions! You're paid dearly for this! Uh, Darko? Oh! You've not heard the last of Darko Gravath! Do you hear me? I shall return! Good work, people. He won't be foiling any more Halloweens. 
Yeah, but what about this Halloween? Thanks to Darko, the dance is a bust. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> Tell that to them. All right, looks like I'm not the only one who came to party. <laughs> DJ Red in the house! <laughs> Crevasse, zombie roadkill, Andy and Abby dancing. Ugh. Ugh, I gotta stop eating Halloween candy before bed. 